So, Paul, can you give us an introduction to what this is I'm looking at right now? Alright. Well, it's Sunday. March, what, 22nd? Yeah. 22nd. We installed the well yesterday in a uh, kind of a hand dug pit. We were trying to find the spring area to uh, see where the water was contributing. We kind of dug out an area and determined by how much water this area was giving us uh, as a potential, you know, dug well source. Um, we installed the well point in and we pumped it and it was giving us more than about six liters a minute at least. That was about the max we could get out of the hand pump. We started backfilling it a little bit with some of the gravel material in there. That actually kind of stopped the flow of water to the screen, so we kind of stopped that for now. Today we're going to be taking um, bacteria samples, and um, we're going to also be taking samples from metal, and uh, just g general metals and inorganics, and also take a look at you know pH, uh, conductivity, and turbidity. You can see the water is actually pretty turbid right now. And this is actually better than it was yesterday now that it's settled out. A lot of the stuff we found in the area has been um, some silty material. And in fact, some of the stuff that we've picked up is a lot more clay and real dense, almost uh, a um, clay with, with some sand in it and some silt. Uh, this area ended up being more of a, a, a sandy, silty sand type of material and has actually given us about eight gallons a minute, timing it, filling the hole up. So, that's where we are today. For the gold, for the poor, for the rich, for the young, for the old, for the man, for the woman, for the woman, for the child, for the tears of God that are falling in the now, for the joy, for the pain, for the sun, for the rain, for the African blood that is all in our veins. I don't want to see another child on his own, no shoes, no clothes, no food, no home. I don't want to see another child on his own, no shoes, no clothes, no food, no home. I don't want to see another child on his own, no shoes, no clothes, no food, no home. But it's